Hi boys and girls. We are continuing on with making sets to match our numbers. In the last two we did, you had to count the numbers, the number of kids on the bus or the number of candies in the jar. This one, you're given the number and you must find the right jar that matches the number. So we'll look at number, just look at this one right here. So Ms. Brown is going to look at this one. So when the jar is full, like this, we know we have 10, right? How many is in the other jar? How many ones do we have? We have one group of 10, one, two, three, four. So, and four ones. So four ones and one group of 10 give us 14. So you will cut this one out and glue it right in here, okay? Very simple to do. I think you guys can do it. I'm very, very proud of all the work you're doing and keep up the great work. Ms. Brown is so proud of you guys right now. I hope you're using your schedules I sent home and your task completion sheets so Ms. Brown can find out how well you're doing with your work and if you need extra help. I will be talking to you guys soon. Take care and be safe. Before you go, I have a joke for you this time. I think it's time for another joke. Ah, this is a good one. Let's see if you can guess this one. What has to be broken? Okay, you have to break it before you can use it. What has to be broken before you can use it? Who knows? Give up an egg. <laughs> That's right. You got to crack the egg and break it before you can eat it. Have fun. Stay safe and be well. Finger shake. Bye for now.